we both know. Oh my god, come on. I've heard enough out of you, okay, Doug? Now, what the fuck's the problem? Ben! No! This was awesome. This was an awesome turnaround. I don't Poor know Doug. about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow, y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, Ken. I'll do it. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. Okay, we'll look for them. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. We gotta jump! What? No you way! can still hear me breathing. I need a different ah! position for Mike so you don't hear me breathing. <laughs> Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me. Uh. I want you to or not. To be honest, I don't know. But any I position will be wrong. Because this mic is so sensitive, it can probably even hear me picking a nose. I rip Doug. Rip Katya. Stupid man. Uh, rip Duck also. I sent you Squishy on Discord uh, Walking Dead theme song that's not copyrighted and it's possible to use and it's very close to the original one. So I used that one in my uh, next uh, Walking Dead video for episode 2. Did it say how many months it's passed or whatever? Nothing passed. <coughs> they just arrived. Can't I just hold it? No, rather not. Just for a little while, we're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. Oh my god, my stream How's titled. His leg's pretty bad. I'm fine. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? It sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. What the hell? Maybe this city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. Thank you, Squishy. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there! Are you sure? I don't see anything. Didn't I update it? I think I updated the title. Ah, okay, because it still shows me that it's free. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who is this? Is that you up in the bell tower? What the hell 
was that? Silence before the storm. Sounded more like a warning. Ask not for whom the bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It tolls for thee. Ah, that's why it's the bell. Run! No, it was all me. Fuck. Clumsy Kenny. Kenny. Wait, let's shoot Kenny. <laughs> too close, don't you think? Ben! No, <gasps> Ben, help her! Ben? <gasps> you son of a... God damn it! Come on, aim! Move your asses! River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. Oh, give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? <laughs> Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. There's no time! We gotta go! Now! I'll be fine! Just go! He said I'll be fine. He's old enough to take care of himself. I hope so. I'll get the door. You okay? Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Shit, it's gonna get infected. We've gotta get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. That's all you gotta say? No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Yeah. No way we're gonna force that open. Not without making a lot of noise at least. Yep, I'm not talking to men. No way I'm gonna be able to bust through that. Ben. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again, it won't be walkers you have to worry about. I hear you. <laughs> How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck, at least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. I'm gonna go check things out. It doesn't right. look, look solid at all. I don't know, it looks okay. How's he looking? I'm alright. You're not alright. You've reopened your wound, you're losing blood, and God only knows what might have gotten in there. It could be infected, it could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. <laughs> Chris is right. Looks pretty bad. You're as bad as she is. I'm telling you, it's just a... Ah, Jesus! Quit trying to be a tough guy, Omid. 
hell. I'd be crying like a baby my leg looked like that. Please, we have to get him inside. Don't worry. I'm on it. Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? Yeah, I think maybe they did. I think so too. I'm standing guard in case they show up. You don't need to do that. We're gonna be safe inside real soon. Until then, just just stay close to me, okay? Okay. Good girl. She will be a zombie killer, no? Oh. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. I tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? <laughs> My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Well, shit. Every day's a school day. <laughs> All right, so where's the dog? So, where is the dog? Look, a shovel. A shovel is never not useful. Thirsty enough to drink that yet. Not thirsty enough to drink that? If it's a rain water, it's decent. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. Oh, there you go. That's probably a dog. Empty. Eh, that would have been too easy. Let's dig out the dog. Hey, be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. Hey, what's buried down there? I hope that dog is dead. Like, dead for good. Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Ogi, okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? God, the smell. Must have belonged to someone. I don't want to touch it. <clears throat> Can't get it off. Ugh. Okay, that is not cool. <laughs> Are you okay? I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? Don't tell me she's pregnant. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! Mm -hmm. And who can fit through that door? You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Whatever you're gonna do, do it fast. Okay, let me see if I can reach up in there. Be careful, man. <clears throat> oh, oh, just use Clementine as always. Let me try. I think I can... Clem, are you okay? Say something! Ta-da! Ta-da! Good work, Clem. But don't go shooting off like that without asking first, okay? I was just trying to help. I know, and you did good. You just had me worried there for a minute. Can we maybe have this conversation inside? My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Looks okay from here. Everybody in. 
finally back home <clears throat> even though there's no real home No, it's okay. I'm good. I feel better already just being off my feet. Thanks, babe. So, when were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. I was honest. Come on. Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that, and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. Whoever that was on the radio, I think they were trying to help us. They did warn us, didn't they? Maybe you're right. But whoever it was, they're watching us, following us, and they don't want us to know who they are. I can't think of any explanation for that that would make me feel better. Can you? In this world, they can help and they can kill you at the same time. I'm with Kenny on that. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head to the river together. Do you? Suit yourselves, and I'm not gonna wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our ticket out of here. If there's any boats. Place seems secure at least. I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door, understand? Okay. Easy. Is there anything I can do? Thanks. I got it. Hang out with Chris to know me until I get back, okay? Lee, I'm sorry. What for? Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just ask me first the next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown-ups, okay? <laughs> okay. Okay, let's start checking. All empty. I should finish checking the house before heading back outside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nothing. Water's off. Huh? No power. I think power goes out earlier than water. Oh, so the dog name was Walter. All cleaned out. Oh, dog food. And this one is even empty. Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. Yeah, dog food is not that bad as you think. Must have stopped working a while ago. Whoever cleared this place out left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. <laughs> How's it coming? Give me that whiskey. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Just one sip. Looks expensive and heavy. 
Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. Let's get ready for some jump scare, yeah? Not exactly my style. <clears throat> All clear in here. Just one more to check. No. Enough checking. Jesus. Wow. That was the most scary broom ever. It's nothing. Just uh, nothing. Well, place ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down. Jesus. <laughs> Good. Thanks. Is he okay? Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. What the hell? Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? I can't Squish, get him to come Don't out. say that. Oh no. Stay here. I don't want to go up there. Why I need to be the tough guy? Squishy, you be the tough guy. Take over the control and do do this for me. Kenny? Oh, I think I remember this part. I think I saw it on your stream Kenny, when you were playing. You okay, man? Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Like duck, dummy. Kind of a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here, starved to death. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it like I did before. Are you sure? I guess we'll find out. I'm some kind of a senseless bastard. This must have been where he slept. Just ran out of food, like we almost did. Like we still might. All empty. He probably died of dehydration before he starved. Damn.
Poor kid. Must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. Hmm. Well, definitely not shooting. I'm sorry. Yep, I choose him. to do it myself. I'll take care of it. I would afraid to carry them, touch them, whatever. Punch them. Only kicking in the worst situations. No, I'm talking in general about zombies. Can we bury him faster or whatever? Oh yeah, right next to the dog. Come on, can we do it faster? Don't rush. Go be. <laughs> Either way, they made a game in such a way that you cannot play it faster than it is outplayed. Hey Norm, what's up? You should be happy Norm, you, you missed the sad part. You only see the consequences of the sad part. Why there is a button to look closer? Are you crying? No, 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 no. Just some uh, running nose. <laughs> yeah, of course. Hey. <laughs> oh, shit. That was spooky. Hey! Hey! you what the hell do you want from us Lee what's going on didn't have a running nose before didn't you well not uh, you said nothing did I have to say something <laughs> what Lee what the hell were you shouting at Jimmy? I'm fine. I just... I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? He knows what he saw. He just doesn't want to tell us. Lee, what the hell happened out here? All right, that's it. We've been cooped up here less than an hour and we're already going stir-crazy. It's time to get back on track. And get ourselves a boat. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I don't know if it's safe to leave just yet. Why the hell not? 
Walkers look to have cleared out. That's not all I'm worried about. So you'd rather just hunker down here and just let whoever's out there keep us boxed in? Wait for them to starve us out? No thanks. I hate to say it, but Kenny's right. Omid's not in great shape to move, but we can't do anything for him here. Without meds or a doctor, he's only gonna get worse. All right, all right. I'll head to the river with Kenny to scope all right, out. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. ready to move. What about me? You'll stay here with the group. You'll only slow us down. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. I need you to watch out for Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know, it. it's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. I'll be back before you know it, okay? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if we'll I saw time. Lee in uh, season two, so, uh, so I bet we will be, be back. The bench here? <laughs> <laughs> Was that a spoiler? I'm worried about Omid. He's in bad shape. I need you to stay here. Keep an eye on him. He's got Krista for that. If it comes down to it, I can't rely on Krista to do what has to be done. Not with Clementine in the same house. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. You can count on me. Good. I hope I can count on him. Or else I'll shoot him, probably. I know. I hope he learned his lesson. Oh, Doug died because of him? Nah, no, I don't think because of him. Because of Doug. Doug died because of Doug. Well, yeah. If we track down backstory. What's wrong with Kenny? <clears throat> if Doug wouldn't move, he wouldn't die. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, river's right up ahead. Ben would die if Doug wouldn't move. That's Son simple. Of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What in the hell is going on? The squishy, it's more like uh, Whatever, if you man. jumped off the roof doing that, I'll ring their to kill yourself, then you jumped off the roof to kill yourself. No one, like, pushed you off the roof. And Doug kind of, kind of did that. In one way. He tried to, like, push Ben away from the bullet. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Gotta be. Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Maybe we need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. Damn, I will piss on you if you start being jerk. one might still be salvageable. You 
better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. See that telescope? You can see all the way along the waterfront from right here. See what you can find. Okay. Yeah, Squishy, I was watching your stream. I don't know how far away. Why my memory is so good now? There will be some Sonny Blake type of a uh, girl. <clears throat> Great. Needs a quarter to work. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Damn. Built solid. Yep. Stay out. Do something like this. Hmm. <laughs> no, we won't be shooting here. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Markings. Is that oh. oof marks? Oof. <laughs> oh no, that's a uh, not oof. Could be military tech. Probably it was oof. What do they mean? Oh. I will get my coin. Maybe there's some change in the drawer. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Too easy. <laughs> Did he say hello, beautiful? Someone already looted the place. Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Someone must have been living up there. Looks like the whole city has been boarded up for all the good it did. Yeah, yeah, I'll ask Kenny, yeah. I just want to look around. Like, look, what's that? Looks like it's still intact. I want a newspaper to read some news. Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. <laughs> yep. It didn't go as planned at all. You got a quarter on you? Don't have a lot of use for small change these days. Maybe you can find one on the street somewhere. So I had to ask him, yeah? Or do I need to ask him again? Jesus. Better just let him do his thing. Yep, yeah. okay. <coughs> You know what? Better not. Gunfire will just bring more walkers. 
Okay. Wait. I already watched it. Bam, Norm, thank you for the pizza. But all of this mess kind of don't bring me any appetite. <laughs> That ain't gonna work. Don't think I'm gonna see anything until I find a quarter. <sighs> Kenny, as always, he finds some, some train, some car, some boat, and just sits in it for ages. The beer. I should probably stick close to Kenny. It's too dangerous out here. I checked that option on top also. Or do you mean option to climb up? Someone already looted the place. I checked this and I checked that. Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Oh, or something. Yes, yeah, siphon, tires removed, engine parts missing. Looks like this thing has been stripped clean. <laughs> stripped clean. Must have been a hell of a wreck. Oh my god. New option on the newspaper? Yep, let's do it. Thank you, Squishy. Ha! I would gladly hit with that tool, I don't know, Kenny. That would be helpful also. What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hull's cracked beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... what the hell is that? <laughs> A fate worse than death. Okay. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. No way that one's salvageable. Nope. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. No sign of any boats down there. Nothing. Look up. The Talmadge Memorial Bridge. Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started to fall. Wait, there was option. Nothing. Oh no. Look right. <laughs> Up and right? Or all the way? I have checked right. You suck, kill yourself. You cannot kill yourself in the game. In this game at least. Le there you go! What the hell? That's what I needed to find. Get down! Get down! Why 
Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? No objections? Good. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet. Take Let him surprise. kiss you? What? Are we playing the same Just game? Want to talk to this guy? Oh, we're grass going to talk. cow human. Sneaky picky, sneaky picky. Do, 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 do. I will get my uh, uh, ass kicked. Definitely, and she won't be here. She won't be here. I remember that one. No. What the? Oh shit! <laughs> Ducky Ducky Walking Dead. Yes, that's the game. No! What is she doing here? Clem? What the? Please don't hurt him. Yeah, that's some crazy assassin creed or something. You're not from Crawford. Crawford? What the hell are you talking about? We can't kiss yet. We need to, like, uh, go out on a date, uh, cinema. Kenny, don't! Ah, oh, damn no, that clumsy lost. Kenny. And this girl just wants to kill everybody. Who the hell are you people? I asked you first. Kiss each song. <laughs> Grass cow I'm human, late. what's wrong with your kissing? I'm looking for I don't trouble. know. Hi. Hello? You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? No, I'm from Macon. Kenny here's from Florida. She didn't ask for our life stories, Lee. What's the deal with this Crawford place? You sure you want to know? When everything started Sutter. going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive, stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. What do you mean, no children? Why and the not? fireworks. No children, no Thank elderly, you for the fireworks. no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived. While the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. But still, children. You're not saying me. In God's name, why? No one stays in Crawford unless they can pull their own weight. Otherwise, you're just another mouth to feed, another drain on their precious resources. What does that mean, pull their own weight? It just means being able to help out, like you do all the time. Doesn't sound like any kind of way to live to me. Couldn't agree more. Can we go now? How do you know all this? Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except no this kiss. Not true. Hey, a drift imp. Thank you for the follow. Was that you at our house this morning? Watching me through the back fence? 
But that was no. no. Believe it or not, I've got better <clears throat> things to do with my time. I just decided to ask. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it. Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us. Fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa. And the sparks. Before I damn it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. That's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. Well, that's pretty smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just Bunch gotta of move dumbasses. Back, get in and out before <laughs> they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Look, I'm sorry we bothered you. Just want to get her back home. We're not going anywhere until I find us a goddamn boat. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. Yes, I totally agree with you. Undead have feelings. You know. Fuck! Especially hey, in that movie, Warm Bodies, down? if you haven't seen it. Nightmare Boss. Shit. Thank you for Since the Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Oh, now right. we need to run. Right. Squishy, did you like Warm Bodies? Isn't that the... Gunshot must have brought him back. I also say it was okay movie. Mom, is there really nice noises? You just gonna let her go? Hey, you can't just leave us here. Really? Watch. No, please, please don't leave us. You mean parkour? Come on, make it fast. Come on, Kenny. Calm, be calm. Click, 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 click. Bye, bye. Wait. Now the <laughs> they will still attack me, yeah. Move. <laughs> Stupid zombie. Find the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles? Clementine, can you hear me? If you can hear me, just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. Guys, stop with the zombie kissing thing. I don't think that's... Uh, Shit. That saves the zombie apocalypse or whatever. Yep, I'm in the sewers where uh, all the poop happens to go you know when when you flush the toilet uh. no way I can pry that open okay let's go let's go probably in here where there was a pizza you probably I just lied it on some diarrhea thingy Be down here too. 
Can I take them? Ain't touching that. Last thing I need is some god awful disease. Okay. Ain't <laughs> touching that, yeah. Uh Proceed to touch with the shoes. <laughs> it's a drainage pipe. Squishy, maybe you remember how you did that. Just do it so I don't walk around forever. The eating. Now it's your big chance. I need to find a valve. Yeah, there's the valve. Do I need to turn this valve or not? Looks like some kind of drainage pipe. Won't turn anymore in that direction. Oh, splashy water, splashy water. Is it trying to drink? Oh, sh shit. Can I open with this one? I think he's close here. Kick butt Mario. <laughs> There's no Mario in here. Washing zombies. So, oh, okay, I see. <clears throat> I see what he's doing here. Close that behind you so they don't follow you. Let's wait a little bit while they pass. They are thirsty. They were eating all day. Please, you just lay down there. Don't you wake up. Oh, oh a gun. God. Chuck, you must have tried to hide out down here. The Glock out my butt. <laughs> I know, right? He must have saved the last one for himself. Now I have the Glock and the revolver you out of my bad, butt. The guy, yeah, that was the old man, right, with the shovel. What the... Oh my god. No, no, don't shoot! Fuck! Why did I shoot? Why did I shoot? It's bad. It's very bad. X. Now next. Boom. Let's go. Those bars are way too far. What do I need to... There. Door open? No? 
break in. Oh, come on. What should I do now? Up? Oh, there. Wow. He's clumsy. I told you he's clumsy. I already told you he's clumsy probably a hundred times. She's coming to keep the kids too. <laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> I misclicked. I didn't want to use a gun there. Oh, food! Wonder if someone's living down here. A bed and a food. Look at all this. It's enough to keep people alive for months. Yo, I'm rich. I can just stay here. Do we have a toilet and a shower, maybe also? It's not smart to misclick in the zombie apocalypse. <laughs> I bet. Uh, hello. Who are you? I could ask you the same question. You barged in on us, and and I'm the one holding the gun. So I'll ask you again. Who are you? Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you, folks. James I'll Charles. Just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I'll know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I came here with a small group hoping to find a boat. We just want to get out of here. How about you just let me go? Ain't no boats around here. Crawford took everything. Yeah, I heard. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Thank wow. Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Look, I don't want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? Kiss him. You won't even tell us who you are. My name is Lee. I'm a history professor. I don't want to die today. And I don't think you want to kill me either. Am I a don't, history don't professor, close, really? Or I'll shoot. Come on. Let's just talk about this. Vernon, what are you doing? Shoot him! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Relax. I'm not here to hurt you. Now I have free guns in the butt! <laughs> You're really not from Crawford? No. I'm really not. Well... We are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so the perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here. Stay hydrated, guys. We're in remission, but that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? A morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did That's you where find they sleep? Down here? I told you. My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Now I just want to get out of here and find them again. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? My but gym locker is I'd nice. Like to help you. But we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care. And I'm the only doctor here. You guys crazy. Besides, why should we help you? Grass cow human and uh, nightmare bros. Maybe you should hang out together. Look. Sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. 
She's your daughter? No. She lost her real parents. I'm doing what I can. You're not seriously considering going with him. It's all right, Bree. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go. Why are they nodding? Why they are nodding? I don't like that nodding. Clementine? Clem? Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. No. Ah, we don't need to lie. Please, the story I goes faster when we don't lie. Krista, what's wrong? It's Omid. He's gotten worse. Much worse. We have a Much man worse? Who's you this? You mean like he turned? This is Vernon. He's a doctor. Oh, thank God. Could you take a look at him? You have to help us. Please. Stand a little bit closer, see what I can do. Take and there will it. be a kiss for Grass Cow Human and uh, Nightmare Bros. He looks like a zombie. He's just old, guys. That's how old people look, like zombies. Oh, <laughs> honey, be all right. Did I just Leave say that? <laughs> Sorry, all Grandpa right, and Grandma. I work better without an audience. I'm sure you have more things of your own to attend to. Yeah, guys, you need to go outside and look at the people. Some people are, are old, you know. Clementine. Clementine? Or oh, is it Clementine? Clementine, you hear? Clem? Guys, keep the chat cleaner. Hello? What are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Where's Clementine? Don't ask me, I'm not her keeper. Hey. Do I look like I'm in the mood to be jerked around? Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? Okay. She's annoying. Is this the way downstairs? Clem? Clementine? Clementina? Clementine! Come out! Please! Is the Clementine a type of Can orange? You? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell They're do drinking? you think you're doing? What does it look like? He's drinking. Where'd oh you my get God. the bottle? <clears throat> Found it. You want to throw down again like back on the train? Because I fight better when I'm shit-faced. Kenny, come on. Give me that. 
Shit faced. Oh my god. Kenny, give me the damn bottle. Get the fuck away from me. Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked. Molly said there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. We got walkers all around us, that crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink? I think the best time for the drink would be when we find a boat. Have either of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, how did Clementine sneak out of the house? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. She was frantic, and things got kinda crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Z88.3 is messing with you. Who's Z88.3? With no one watching her? Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. She better be or it's your ass. Now I missed what he said. Where did he say he saw her? Clementine? Outside? Clementine! Guys, the chat is strange. I don't know what you're trying to... Where you're trying to get with that chat. What the hell? Pull out one of your free guns. The one with the bullets. You are all friends. Oh, that's why. Hey, girl. Come look. Look what I found. Probably that's how you guys trying to uh, cover up your uh, uh, fearness to this game, yeah? Oh, we found a boat. This was here the whole time? I know, right? Look at that smile. You don't even need a drink anymore. That was a wine? I don't think he would be so drunk because of the wine. Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Uh, am I allowed to say a racist joke? Well, no. If you haven't read the rules on the bottom of the screen, the good news I mean, the bad in the description, news? there is some rules, guys. I think we could all use some good news. Good news is, the boat's seaworthy enough. In pretty good shape, mostly. Mostly? That's the bad news. Gas tank's empty, and her battery's dead. We need to fix both before she's taking us any place. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? We should go back out on the street, see what we can find. That's not gonna work. Crawford took everything and brought it inside their walls. They siphoned every gas tank, stripped every battery. There's nothing left out there. You saw that for yourselves. She's right. Well? What about this Crawford place? Sounds like they'd have everything we need. 
Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You uh, show I'm from Lithuania. Man, we are assuming well everyone's gender, so... They don't probably. exactly welcome children <laughs> with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. That's putting it mildly. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. Is this grandpa helping us? I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. What about the sick Maybe guy? I'm also I've thinking what's wrong before, with the sick guy. They, they're not the talking about him. Do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in Hopefully return he's for okay. this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? Few more seasons doesn't tell me that tonight. the boat will lead us to where we need to go. <laughs> I'll let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. In New York, you assume That's everybody's gender. <laughs> I told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. How he's not that drunk anymore? Well, when the miracle happens, the drunkness just go away. I can't lie to you, Clem. I just don't know. I don't want anyone else to die. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. I guess I should go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. I'm we being nice, I'm being nice, guys. Dad are, right? She's a nice lady, nice girl. Clementine, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Omid. But what if something happens to him while you're gone? What do you mean? He's sick. If he doesn't get better and, you know, he might try to hurt me. Stop it. <laughs> Can't I come with you? <laughs> I'll try. Um, no, no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Squishy, did you choose to take her with you? When you were playing? No? You also don't want to lose her, yeah? You, grass, and cloud are all friends. Hatchet, Lovely. Hacksaw, some other tools might come in handy on this little break-in. Where are you all from? Yes. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So we're going to have a capacity problem. Boat that size ain't going to hold more than five people. Even with one of them... A Russia? Me? 
you, Claire, Krista, Omi, Ben. No shit, suka blit. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, that's still one too many. Even if we cut Molly loose. Before this is over, we're gonna have to make a decision. You're not serious. Soviet but, Union. I'm just saying, if we want the best chance of... The Soviet Union, okay. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Help us how? She's I Bree? I know there's cheese, Bree. Supplies. I know the layout. With her help, we're you eat it with fashion. the Anyone have a blue grapes. With that? I guess not. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. Uh, we will take your country. <laughs> wow. Hold up just a sec. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omid. But what should I do if something happens while you're gone? There's too many zombies, it will be too hard. Here, Look. I want you to take this. You remember a revolver you for her? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So if anyone tries to get inside the house that isn't one of us, or if something does happen... She will make a flip when she will shoot with a revolver. Let's get you inside. <laughs> You're sorry in advance, okay. Guys, try to stick, uh, stick with the game. I will try to be as interactive as possible, but I want to stick with the game. Let's get this over with. We shouldn't go uh, around the game uh, topic. This should be it. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet, we stay hidden, and we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? We don't even know where we're going, bro. I think we will get busted. Let's go. Bree and uh, Vernon. Is everybody? Okay. There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, try to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind We will you. take him out quietly? Wow. I don't think this will be like a very nice way to chop his head off, no? What the fuck? What the hell? Is a walker doing inside here? There's inside, only walkers. Fast. Oh my god. <clears throat> Is this like uh, their protection or what? I don't want to go into this dark place. Course. Definitely. Shit. Are you afraid? No, Reggie. No. What the hell happened? It's here? not that scary as it looks. It's supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. It's all over. We should leave this place. Now. 
No, listen to me. Before, everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Get what we need and get the hell out of here. Come on. I think I know which way to head. I got a bad feeling about this. Well, he might be having a bad feelings too, no? Yeah, Squishy. Enjoy your games. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. Song Armory, <laughs> nice. Of course, it's Thank locked. You. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Here. Just give me a sec. Any idea where we could find a battery? Uh, maybe at the auto shop. There used to be one in the alley outside the fire escape. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Reggie, can you guess which Turn one is the main it. character? The one I'm right controlling? Here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Okay, oh, which I'll man? make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. Uh, probably you already no noticed the one I controlled. Okay, guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. <laughs> the dark with the beard. Okay, we've got a plan. <laughs> yep, Everyone that's right. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. The one with the very white noise, uh, voice. What do I need to do here while I'm waiting? Crayons and construction paper. So, according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office, and a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. Why does he need to repeat that? Uh, the fuel's in a shed across from the playground. It's just outside the stairwell. And if we're gonna find medicine anywhere, that would be the place to look. Hey, Reggie, thank you for the sparks. The auto shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. Where am I going? Where am I going? I 
I didn't have time to read. Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. I don't want to go anywhere. I'm okay in this room. Did any of the others come back yet? No, you're the first. You might want to go check on them, see if they need any help. Sure thing. The Georgia State flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Looks like they had quite a system here. Crawford's final solution. later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. Yep, we no need something to read. No TV. Hey Norman with pizza, stop throwing pizzas or I want the pizza. <laughs> Hopscotch. I'm so so hungry will be soon. Especially a pineapple pizza. Where I can get a pineapple pizza now? Okay, now it's a uh, pizza with uh, pepperoni. Also hungry. Let's just go. Maybe there will be a jump scare soon. There should be one jump scare in uh, every every every. The alleyway episode. to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Wait, wait, wait. What's that? They've already been fired. They're worthless. Where did she so say to go here? This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? Molly, you out here? Molly. Guess Good call, Miss Molly. Auto shop must be down this way. Molly, what? Did you see that, guys? Do I need to turn around? I don't want to turn around. Why did we jump over? How will I get back now? Huh? Better not get too close. Those zombies look friendly when they don't want to eat you. Leave him! He's mine. What? Where the hell have you been? Molly? <laughs> Molly! What? I think you got it. <laughs> yeah. One more. He's wearing medical scrubs. 
Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Of course he ain't shit now. <laughs> Did you find us a way in? Yeah. I started to like garage her. garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh yeah. That'll she work. was carrying that with her. Wow. We need to work faster. Come on. Oh, come on. Turn, 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 there you go. And this one is still alive. Are they blind? Seriously, they're blind. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Perfect. No power. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. Rules, rules, rules everywhere. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Luther will be shot on sight. It's locked. No way in. I can't reach it up there. That blinking. Must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. It's the panel that controls the hydraulic lift over there. I cannot get in there. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Right, let's go ask her if she have something cut it with. Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? <laughs> Hilda. Her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. <laughs> I got your promise now. Not a scratch. She's funny. I did it. Whoa, whoa. That's probably not good. No shit. <laughs> There's the battery. Finally, something goes right. It's still attached to the terminals. It's still attached to the terminals. I got this. It's off. Got that one off. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here, I'll carry it. Okay. Put the battery me. in the bag. Do you know how heavy batteries are? Move your ass! It's not that easy to carry with one off. I moved. Oh move up there, okay. <laughs> Skylight. 
It's shut. Shoot it out. At least she can pull me up, not like Kenny. Kenny always loses me. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. And she have a battery in her backpack. Jumping like that with the battery. Car battery. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. Yes. <laughs> of course I missed. I need to die a few times. Okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. What did you call me? Well, now that you mention it. <laughs> I clicked! Come on. This aiming sucks. Okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! I don't know, man. Probably I needed to click before. I was thinking I need to reach her a little bit closer, but apparently I could click earlier than that. Oh my god, this game is easier than I think sometimes. Come on! Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you've still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Mom! Yeah, she's smart. Damn it, what the hell is she doing? Fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. I think those uh, guys will be waiting for us at our place. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. You get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? 
Yeah, but what has she done for me lately? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. He will kill you. Look, Ben, I really don't have time for this. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it. But it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. He will kill him still. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old. Even children. Those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. How long have you known Vernon? Couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together. Kept us alive. So you're a cancer survivor? Like Vernon and the others? Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. Lost wow. my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? You survived the cancer and then the zombie apocalypse. I'm a Boom! Busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. How are you guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. So I need to go medicine myself again. I don't like walking alone. Sounds bad. Shit. Oh, what? <clears throat> what the hell? Vernon must be trapped in there. Should I? Should I shoot all of them? Easy. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? 
Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four. Just shoot with a gun, and well, it will we open. Just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. Phones probably haven't worked in months. Looks like some kind of medical file. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. I'll have to take time to rest later, I think. When will I rest then? Season 5? What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. Looks pretty sturdy. No way we're gonna force that open. We might be able to find something to pry it open, but it'll take time. We don't have time. Omid needs that medicine. We have to get it open now. Do you think shooting it open would work? Only thing that would accomplish is getting us all killed. So, no, I don't. Boring. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Uh, already cleaned out. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? Is he a detective or something? The way this camera is set up, it looks like it would have had a pretty good view of that keypad. I wonder if it caught someone punching it in. Empty. Figures. The tape's got to be around here somewhere. Keep looking. Why do I need to keep looking? It's not working. How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Molly helped me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. Hey, Doc, uh, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us, and for all your help. I really appreciate it. Don't mention it. It's times like these we've got to help each other the most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. I heard that. How much time do you think Omid has, Doc? You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Let's just leave it at that, huh? I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. Good idea. Probably I need to <coughs> go out. Boys, locked. Uh, didn't need to 
use the bathroom anyway. Bone dry. Sounds like there's a shit ton of walkers out there. <laughs> Should I open the door? Open arms is open. <laughs> no, no, please. Yes, your name is Green. Hey, I. I'm a little because busy here. You're maybe, uh, maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. Punk ass bitch. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. It's more like kick ass. Is this a code? Could this be a code? I'm reading it. I mean... Initials of a person... Conducting search... Day since outbreak... Number of walkers, number of citizens brought to Crawford, number of ineligible citizens found. I know. I was thinking maybe it's just uh, some kind of uh, trick to hide the number. Come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. How you guys doing with that door? Slower than I'd like. Don't worry, we'll get it open. I think. Oh, come on. They're not helpful at all. Nobody. Nobody. Nothing but crayons and construction paper. I don't like passing that door again. Like. <laughs> Do I need to climb up there, maybe? Bobby, you there? Can't reach it. It's too high up. Molly could reach it. Look, there is this locker. I don't know the code for. There's a bunch of zombies I shot. Did I get everything? Yeah, I think I did. Oh, I mean, we got the battery and... What's wrong with her? Hey, Krista. Yeah. The T-Pos, yeah. Are you feeling okay? I'm fine. Why are you asking me that? It's just that you've been looking a little pale the past couple of days. You've been throwing up. Oh, come on. You just dug up a rotting dog carcass. I'm surprised we weren't all throwing up. Lee, rotting dog Quit carcass? Oh. Worry about Omi. We've got to get that him dog. These meds. Are you making any progress with the safe? No. Without the combination, I don't know how we're going to get this damn thing open. If we don't get uh, back to Omi, it's a mess and soon. It's okay, we'll figure it out. I still didn't find the tape. I hope I did the right thing leaving Clementine back at the house. Do you know where's the tape? Do? Bring her on a dangerous mission? I know, Squishy. I know. Just want her to be safe. Why shouldn't she be? No offense, Krista, but Omid's pretty sick. If he dies with Clementine alone in the house with that her... He said there's no tape. Happen. Do you hear me? That is not going to happen. We're going to get these meds to Omid, and he's going to be fine. He's going to be fine. You're right. I'm sorry. Look, Lee, I just want to get back to Omid. 
Let me do my thing, all right? Okay. Maybe battery. No tape inside. You see, no tape inside. Boat battery we got, fuel we got, we need meds. And this guy told me to find the tape. Go outside through all of the zombies? Or is the tape somewhere here? Then I should go here probably. Not going back out there unless I have a damn good reason. Yeah, you see? I don't have good reason for that. Shell casings all over. Whatever happened here wasn't good. Where can I find the tape? Oh, maybe those tapes at the. Uh... No, zombies, not you guys. No, no, no. I will open if I won't find a solution. <laughs> There were, I think, s no, there weren't tapes under the... Here's nothing. I hate this stuff in games. It should be easier. Walking around a half day trying to find the stupid tape. No power, no TV. No power, no TV. Might come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. Asbury, I, I think I did also talk with you. Only have like no answers. Hey, I. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. <sighs> busy with what? Looking at this? So according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you skip that? And a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. No. He cannot skip that. He needs to say everything. You should be able to go outside. Get tape from zombie. Outside through the back door? Must be the guy who ran if I miss something that I didn't I really some kind of supreme leader. Didn't really notice what I missed. Molly! What the hell is she doing? This place definitely has some major damage. Can't open it without the combination. Logan. Too bad I don't know the combination to any of these. Maybe any of the zombies have the tape? Ah! Oh, bro! Come on! How did I miss that one? That'd be a first. It was in front of your face, you grandpa.
Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure! I want my baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. He didn't use the code. Damn it! We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Uh -huh. Maybe right. you should search it. See what he's got on him. Now I can go find that doctor. I need to do all the dirty things. Okay. Get ready. Here, doctor, 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 doctor. And he won't be there. Right? Because he was still alive. Can you run? <laughs> Holy! <laughs> Misclick! Where did that TV came from? <laughs> Oh my god! What the? Wait a minute, where do you think you're going? Damn, there was one jump scare. There's always needs to be a jump scare. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. Yay, I got the code. safe combination was only four numbers. Shit, time to go. How did he get up there back? I think we need to go faster. Logan. This must have been his locker. Another tape. Safe combination has got to be on one of these. I found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy, 
or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed hmm. up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes, if this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you, please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. That's what happened. Did we got the code? know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. <laughs> Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much <gasps> morphine, yeah. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. No tape inside. Of course, you dumbass. I misclicked. Genius. <laughs> Oh Listen, wow. As fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Did he just zip his uh, zipper before he start recording or whatever? Well, shit. <laughs> oh, that pregnant lady is Molly's sister? Like I did really care. Jesus Christ! <clears throat> you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. I'm just kidding. Stop dicking around. Here you go. She holds that battery like it's a poppy or something what's that nothing you lied to me what you said you'd never been here before but that wasn't the truth was it what who told you that I saw you on a security tape you were having an affair with that doctor I didn't lie I asked you how you knew about Crawford you said you just heard stories I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. What? When started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. 
Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could. But in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. Yep. I didn't <clears throat> want him to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? I'm sorry for what happened to your sister. But right now, I just want to get the job done and get back to the house. What the hell? Oh, I gently changed I the subject. To get the hell out of here. And. Oh, Jesus! Shit. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look <laughs> for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Fireworks. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh my god, Ben, I will kill you. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> ben, such a dumbass! Oh my god, you got you! Shoot this fucker! Domo! Yay! Nice shot. Thank me later. Come on! I almost hit you, bro. Ben, we gotta go. Ben! Move your ass! Oh my god. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! <laughs> Norm, those pizzas this won't help, Ben. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben needs Talk brains. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. I let them in. Ben, shut the fuck up. Fuck you, Lee. I can't do this anymore. It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Oh, wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them Ben off is our your backs. favorite character of all time? That's when they attacked. That's I have a feeling he's fight. dying right now. I mean... You see? You see? He's stupid. Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Yes, I sided with you Kenny. Kenny finally, You're fucking dead. You hear me? Dead. Finally, I'm My with wife Kenny. And child, you gotta both fucking kill. Kenny, listen to me. Hey, you sweet, can sweet, sweet last Viking. But right now, we gotta go. How are you doing? Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. Hello. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind. Kenny, we'll sort this out later. Later. After we get later. out of here, okay? We, we can Ain't kick him, we out. can I just punch him. The, way it's gonna be. the boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left Now behind. I'm doing great Might because well be I was stuck in this right game here. like walking forward and backward, forward and backward looking sorry, for some man. stupid tape that was on the table all, all along. I'm playing this first time, so... <laughs> <laughs> I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? <laughs> I didn't really like this lady, so... Oh well. Now can we go? And Damn her name right. was funny. Vernon, come on! Yes, I found all the tapes, all three of them. Yeah. We got it. We we uh, checked it. Uh, uh, 
So much for the armory. What's left of it? That's an armory? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. Kind of have feeling we should go up. Oh, surprise, mother... <laughs> it's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Oh, a shotgun. Lee, look! <laughs> Do I need to shoot? Alright, give me shooting. I can shoot. Use the left stick uh, to get away. Yes. And... And... I wanted to hit that guy. Oh, no, no, no. not coming out. Probably I needed to shoot then pull out the leg. Look up to fight. Select your leg to free it, look up to fight. How can I select my leg to free it and look up to fight at the same time? He's also clumsy. What? Okay. I'm in a tough spot. <clears throat> yeah. Bring the axe. Yeah. Whoa, 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 wait. Come on. I almost felt like... Uh, Damn, I forgot. Rick! I almost felt like Rick with an axe. Damn. Squishy, I'm not on a PC, I'm on a Xbox controller. But I'm getting better. Hey, give me back my axe. Come on. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find if a way I'm down. If I'm looking like cheaper than the mouse, will it from the railroad, work? Did you? Yeah. Why? In Never some mind. games, it works. I can see the sewer when we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, go. Things. Jumping or what? Come on, let's go! Hey Swedish Viking, very thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> Wrong button! Oh my god, that was a good one. Seriously. Sorry. Got you. Got you, Ben. Don't worry. You're stupid Climb like a Come fish, on, you but do it. you no make me fun, uh, happy. Now. Look it around, Ben. Come on. Let go, damn it! Get the others out of here. What? Please. No, let go. Not for Kenny. For Kenny, I'm not killing anybody. No. Oh my god, come Let on. Go. Pull. Let's go. Go, go, go. <laughs> I 
I could misclick. Sometimes I misclick. Oh, Mead? Clementine! Yes, he did some mistakes. Clementine! But, I mean... He's good now. You made it back! Told you I would, didn't I? Did you find my parents? No, we didn't. Mm, nope. I'm sorry, sweet pea. I looked for them, but no. Clementine, what happened here? One of those things got inside. It tried to get upstairs. I stopped it. Upstairs? Oh, Mead. You did good, kiddo. Real good. Hey, what do you say we go check on Omi? Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Uh... Krista, get away from him! <clears throat> oh, you let Clementine come, come with you? Hey. Was that helpful? Back already? We got you medicine. Good. I feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? Hey, he's you okay. Than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. I don't know Should why, but I like Ahmed. We had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let oh, he shot to tell you. Walker, who tried to, to grab do. Molly. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Tom. But if... Yes. Thank if you, you took so Clementine much. with you, then Amit should die. They die, Maybe I mean. now's a good time for you Walker and me would to come. a little talk in private. No? Listen, man. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over. Oh, then the walker is not there. Wow, wow. You want to know the worst part? <clears throat> what? This game is made perfectly. I, mean, <laughs> I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now, it's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. Hey, with sweet Swedish Viking with a host. Thank you very much for the host. No destination. Do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me, to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I know it's a lot to consider, but I want you to think about some things. You're a good man, Lee. I'm you I'm not giving Clementine to this can so far and grandpa. To Rightly so. But it's different with a child. You might have brought her this far, but sooner or later she might ask you for more than you can give her. I'm sorry if that's hard to hear. But it's No, I'm true. not giving. I appreciate it, Vernon. Let me think about it, okay? You do that. But I respect the old guy, so I just tell him, like, you know, I I'll think about it. Sell her. <laughs> How much should I ask? It's a... It's a zombie world, and there's... Money don't have any value. Hey, going somewhere? <laughs> 500 rocket launchers. Yeah, <laughs> that makes I'm sense. about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. So that's it? After all we've been through, you'd 
You just gonna leave? Yeah. Hey, I thank you for the sparks. You don't owe me uh, anything. Grass? I got what I wanted in Crawford, and I never did like the water. Where will you go? I don't know. I'll figure it out when I get there. What do you want me to Even tell more sparks. Tell them Ooh. Whatever you want. Oof, oof, oof. I'm not real big on goodbyes. Tell Clementine she's going to be okay. Swedish Viking with the ten thousand. Working on the boat. <laughs> now we're calling her Sweet Pea. <laughs> what are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Well, he's been through a lot, Clem. He's just gotten a little overwhelmed, that's all. I'm sure he'll be fine. Yeah, I also was thinking she could yeah, she he <laughs> said like sweet pea. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. I'm like super honest with Clem. I was super honest. Super. Oh, a hug? I'm not her father and uh <laughs> <sighs> Clementine? At least he had a nap. Clementine? After I don't know how long. Or is he f dreaming again a uh, nightmare? Please, no nightmare with Clementine. I don't like nightmares with Clementine. Like that one where she, where she was... Like, I'm not feeling right. And then she's like zombie. Blah! Clementine? Clementine! Oh, God. Don't tell me it was... It wouldn't happen different way if I would say something else? So squishy. Clementine stayed with you? This is not that right, becoming human. I really would like to play that right, but uh, for that we need a PlayStation. What? No. 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 Oh, fuck. Lee? Lee? You out here? Lee. Oh shit. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Where's Clementine? I She's know, I need room. to show. Vernon ain't in the house either. And apparently they will chop my hand off. Whose blood is that? Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. 
Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? I don't know what to do here. I don't even know if I can ask for your help. Lee, we're a team. That's how we've made it this far. We're not going to just abandon you. Even now? Especially now. You've earned that much. Damn straight. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting uh, for? <clears throat> I don't want to die. I like I Lee. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine, and I am a Christian man, and I keep asking myself, if this was me, asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there have been plenty of times when you ain't been. You didn't show a reaction uh, when Clementine was missing, but when Lee... Lee. I know you think you and me might have been on the same page, if <laughs> but the way I see it, you've never really had my back. Right from the beginning, you were never looking out for me and mine. Not when it mattered. Clementine is uh, me kind of a hazel to have, to but uh, now. she's a part of me you, because she's from the beginning of the know. game. Whatever you think is best. I didn't go to answer because I was too slow. I can't make that decision for have to decide for yourself. I think maybe it's best I stayed behind. I know you don't have a lot of confidence in me. That's okay. I understand. But you've got enough to worry that about. That was an important one? Without me screwing things up. <laughs> Everything is important in this game. Guess it's just me and you guys. We should go find Vernon. As we soon as it won't end I'll get the boat out onto the here figure and, you, and we can continue back. playing or the next until nightfall. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. He might not make it to the river. The He's cop was uh, also in the beginning, but back. I don't think you didn't yeah. care about him. We'll figure out what to uh, do comes. Yeah, I didn't care much about the cop. Why should I? But he was a nice guy. Come on, he was guys, a nice guy. Go. But he was already, like... <clears throat> when I woke up, he was dead. That's all of his niceness. <laughs> Surprise! Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here! All I want is the girl! Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt! What's happening? Are they all coming in here? Clementine, are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Holy! Oh, that voice. Where have you taken her? This is Vernon. Oh, 
Okay. Oh, come on! On the very interesting part. So, what was my wrong choices? The boy in the attic. Did you kill the boy in a... Yes. 73 players did. Hippocratic Oath. Did you lie to... Triton when... You and 57 players... Were honest. Yeah. Did you bring Clementine with you? You and... 45 players pulled him up. Wait. Left. Left, 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 yeah. From whom the bell to... Uh, did you let Ben fall to his death? No. Look, 45 pulled him and others... Wow, guys. The, the life is most important. I only kill bad guys like... Uh, those uh, cannibals. Uh, the zombies, uh, zombie kids. <laughs> yes, I already killed two zombie kids, so I'm a zombie kid killer. <laughs> the bite revealed. Did you reveal your bite to the group? You and 80% of players did. I don't know why we all did. I was thinking there would be more players who didn't reveal. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> If you wouldn't reveal, I think you would end up dying, no? I'm... I will be... <clears throat> I know guys, you don't want to spoil it. But I accidentally spoiled myself by, I don't know, watching some... Uh, uh, I don't know what... Wallpapers or something. And I saw... Lee... With one arm. So I kind of assume what's going on. Yeah, I know. Sorry. Sorry for that, guys. I, I didn't... I, it was accident. Like Ben. I'm like Ben, you know. I, I, I'm clumsy. <laughs> so, damn. I kind of know. And uh, why not? Same... Uh, very similar... Young and stupid. Yeah, right. Young and stupid. That's correct. <laughs> I mean... Very similar stuff was happening in The Walking Dead, the series. Very similar stuff. In a different colors, I would say. So that's not a surprise at all. Let's see what's next. What's coming up? Who came with you? Uh, uh, what does that make any of a difference? I hope that doesn't make any difference. Wait, it, it doesn't show what will be next, no? No. <clears throat> and your player band followed you too, okay. But did everybody got bitten in this situation? Everyone went with you, wow. You're the alpha in your pack, probably. <laughs> Everyone follows the leader, you know. Because I like Annie. How, how can you like him when he's running away when sh shit hits the fan? He doesn't care f a single thing about anything. He, he even... When I was fixing the train, he was sitting all the time, looking at... The, the, I don't know what. <clears throat> he didn't want anyone around except Ben. Ben is stupid and young, and that makes stupid uh, situations very funny. Molly, on the other hand, she's very sarcastic. But how can you be so sarcastic when there's a there's 
dead people walking around you. <laughs> Probably that that being sarcastic helps. I'm kind of a sarcastic person, but probably I don't like being sarcastic others on me, you know? 